راح يوصل هي إلى جنازة. In Gaza, thousands of Muslims have been killed. And when we talk about patience, Wallahi, I do not know of any people on the face of this earth today that have endured what the people of Gaza and Palestine have endured. Yet they remain strong and steadfast and patient even as they face the worst of enemies, the most ruthless of beings, the most vile and lowly of the creation of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. They're patient. Wallahi, forget about Muslims. Even the kuffar, the disbelievers, they're amazed by the people of Gaza and their patience. So much so that so many of them went to buy the Quran and study the Quran and so many of them became Muslims. They have been forsaken by this Ummah. Forsaken by more than a billion Muslims. Forsaken. Everybody's literally turned against them. The enemies of Allah. Min al-Kuffar wal munafiqeen And even people who claim, Wallahi, people who claim to practice deen. And they have beards. And they shorten their garments to their knees. They dare criticize the people of Gaza and speak ill of them. Can you imagine that? But you know what? وَعِنْدَ اللَّهِ تَجْتَمِعُ الْحُصُولِ All of us and them, we will be gathered in front of Allah on the Qiyamah. And the thing I fear the most, my brothers, is the angels of Allah might tell us Yom al Qiyamah, step aside and we will watch the people of Gaza, as they enter in droves in Jannah. Salamun alaykum bima sabartum fa ni'ma And they will forget all their suffering and all the pain they went through. When you and me were watching Netflix, we could not come to the masjid for Salat al-Fajr. When you and me were concealing and committing sins, smoking shisha, vaping, committing zina and other things that I cannot mention on the member. The people of Gaza, they were going through horrors that nobody has ever seen. And then you and me, we went to Jannah. How cheap can Jannah be? How can you enter Jannah and you're watching Netflix? Can you? How? Tell me. How can you enter Jannah and you have not prayed the price for Jannah? And everyone is standing, including the Munafiq media, the evil media. The shocking thing, even the media of our country. This Amala, this media that serves its masters, they speak the same propaganda being spewed up by BBC and CNN. Lies upon lies. But Alhamdulillah, the whole world is watching and witnessing. And the tide is turning against the enemy. And the end game is the victory that Allah promised the believers.